We're talking about something that's been buzzing in the headlines recently. Asterisk, mpox, asterisk. Which some of you may still know as monkeypox. Yep, we're getting into the nitty-gritty of this viral disease that's got people talking. What is it? Why should you care? And how can we all stay safe? Stick around, because I've got you covered. What is mpox? Well, it's a viral disease caused by the mpox virus. Sound familiar? That's because it's a cousin of the smallpox virus. But before you start freaking out, let me tell you, it's asterisk, way asterisk, milder than smallpox. I mean, nobody wants to catch a virus, but this one isn't here to ruin your week as badly as smallpox would. Fun fact, it was first discovered in monkeys back in 1958, which is how it got the name. But guess what? The real culprits here aren't monkeys. They're rodents from Central and West Africa. Yep, the little guys are the ones we've got to watch out for. Okay, let's talk symptoms. If you get mpox, it starts off like any other bug fever, headaches, muscle aches, swollen lymph nodes. But then, plot twist, you get a rash. And this isn't your average rash. It usually starts on your face and decides to go on a little road trip around your body. But hey, before you panic, mpox isn't as contagious as, say, chickenpox. It spreads through close contact with an infected person, contaminated stuff, or even animals. So yes, it's contagious but it's not out here trying to win a popularity contest. Now here's the good news. There are ways to protect yourself, and it all starts with vaccination. Smallpox vaccines actually work against mpox too. Talk about a two-for-one deal, right? If you're in an area where mpox is spreading or you're at risk, getting vaccinated is like giving yourself a little superhero cape. Plus, don't forget the basics. Wash those hands like you're auditioning for a soap commercial, avoid close contact with sick people, and just keep up that good hygiene. On the global stage, mpox made a big splash in 2022 when it hopped out of Africa and decided to take a world tour. Sweden, for example, saw its first cases, and that got everyone's attention. The World Health Organization jumped in fast, getting everyone on the same page. And here's something cool. The WHO officially renamed the disease from monkeypox to mpox to avoid stigma. I mean, how often do you see a virus get a rebranding? Props to the WHO for that. So, let's wrap this up with the highlights. Mpox is a viral disease, mild, but still something to watch out for. Symptoms include fever, rash, and swollen lymph nodes, and it spreads through close contact. Prevention is all about vaccines and good hygiene. Stay informed, stay safe, and you'll be just fine. Thanks for hanging out with me today. If you learned something new, go ahead and smash that like button and share this video with someone who needs to hear it. And hey, if you haven't already, subscribe for more health tips and updates. I've got some exciting stuff coming your way. Stay awesome, stay informed, and I'll catch you in the next one.